Hello, everybody, and I'm back with my weak man in Project Zomboid. So, you saw me do that fun little murder spree last time. This time, it's going around and gathering what I can. I'm grabbing all the beer. Ooh, we have the cold stuff. Yeah, that should actually do it. reason I'm grabbing the beer is because it does kind of help with settling your thirst and your hunger. And at the same time, the bottles are reusable for water later on, so it doesn't hurt. Well, hi there. First victim of the day. Good night. And you had nothing good on you. Okay. Oh, I'm on my way. No autographs. I'll take those so I can rip them apart later. Let's activate foraging mode and see what I can find on the way up here. Pristine. Of course. Because why wouldn't you be? And of course. Curiosity kills me. Okay. Damn. Oh, hi. Uh, no, sir. No, ma'am. Okay, really? We're doing this again? Okay. Back off. Back off. No. No. Game, let's not get laggy when I'm being chased, okay? Nope, 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 nope. That was a bad swing.
Hey. No extras. Didn't I kill your character model already, lady? Alright, give myself a small breather. Hoo doggy. No. Okay. Okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Somehow I'm okay. You know, I'll go. I'll, I'll start taking maps. Gobble, gobble. It's locked. I'm annoyed. I'm breaking it open. I'm hoping the keys to the car are inside. I really do. Okay, let's see. Oh, beautiful. Oh, give me that milk. Mmm. Can I eat these strawberries? And I'm going to eat this orange. And no. Damn. No keys for the car. That's sad to see. It means I gotta really work to get my electrical up. Because if you got two mechanics, one electrical you can hotwire. Zombies keep attacking me in the droves that they do. My strength is going to hit its first level by the time this episode's done. Got to move all sneaky deaky like. Well, let's enter foraging mode to see if anything pops up that's hidden to me. Nice. No, it's just a piece of grass. Okay, I thought it looked like keys, but it's not. I'll just quickly do some foraging around the car. Yeah, no.
Holy crap. It was open. Dish towel. Oh, look at all that food. Nom, 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 nom. What are you set to anyways there, bud? You always wanting on wanted on living in life. Disassemble. These TVs are a decent source, if I'm not mistaken. I really need the electrical book, though. There we go. God, my guy needs fitness. Rest. It's too bad they don't have it set yet that if you go and click, like, rest on a thing of furniture and whatnot, your guy doesn't go and just sit down. It would be nice. It would be nice. Okay. I know I should probably wait for the whole resting bar, but... Moseying down the street. And I'm going to continue foraging as I do to gather materials. Because this lead pipe ain't going to last forever. Yeah, that ain't going to last forever. Yeah, I can't even make a spear yet. I don't have a, uh, a shtick. So I'm going to make my way up to an old neighborhood I usually go and actually set up shop in. Ooh. Sure, pointy rock. Exhausted from just crouching? I guess that makes sense. Yeah, these houses up here. I'm close to the neighborhood I generally go through, and I did whip through here on a vehicle. So the zombies would have started chasing the vehicle, so they would have moseyed a little bit. a big stone. Gotta get that foraging experience up. Can help you find a lot of good stuff when you get it leveled up. Sure, it limits your field of view, so if it's an area you haven't been in, it's not a good idea. But I know this area well enough. So we have no car in the driveway of this house today. Okay. Alright.
There we go. Sleep. All right, grab corpse. Main reason for doing that. is because, well, <laughs> if you end up sleeping in the house, but you got a dead zombie inside, you can actually start to get sick because of the zombie being there. Hmm. Yummy, yummy, yummy. I wonder, can I actually cook something in that, like, put something in that bowl to eat? Oh. Okay, from beef jerky. Oh, this is going to be amusing. No peanut allergies. <laughs> that was good. Ooh, orange soda. That'll help me down the road. Ooh, peanut butter. And chocolate. And I saw there was a bookshelf. What do we got? What do we got? These ones here are another mod that I have extra books. I may not use them for this gameplay just because. And this one's just for entertainment. Ah, oh, lame, no skill book. Yeah, I can try going to the house next door. Okay, yeah, I didn't think so. I'll just come back. Better safe than sorry. Interesting. Okay, my character is exhausted. But I know what I'd like to do. Exercise! Boink. Slowly raise my strength and fitness through that. 
Like it'll give me a little bit of each. I love that beating on zombies helps your strength, so you really don't even have to work on your strength, just your fitness. And your strength will just get up there. Oh, hey, my short blunt is almost at level 2. Yeah, mechanic gives you short blunt plus 1, because when you think about it, you would expect to be starting with, uh, like, a pipe wrench, a wrench screwdriver and stuff like that. Um, yo. Why are you refusing to let me equip you on my back? You were on my back. Mmm, because it's got so much weight, I wouldn't be able to. Okay, okay, that makes sense. Can I do it now? No. Oh, come on. Oh, what am I doing? I'll just make a new one and transfer everything over. in a good quality bed instead of an average quality cot the exhaustion go away exhaustion barely went away game come on <coughs> well, hold on before I leave And Oh, hey, we got the cook show. Yes, I, I really, but I don't mean 
That's sort of morbid when you said it like that. I mean, it's sort of a risk thing. But, uh, yeah, but the way I said it, the tone in which I said it was actually almost whimsical and humorous. That is, this is what I am. Cool. So now my cooking skill has gone up a bit. So it's almost at level one. That's nice. Living in Life TV is the best show you can put on in the first week of the game. Because you always get your carpentry up pretty quick. You can even get your mechanics up pretty quick if you catch it at the right time, though I'm not too sure what time that is. But your carpentry is the big one that you want to get up. Carpentry is easy, and hopefully I find some boxes of nails in order to help with that. Well, I think this person drank themselves to death. They have an empty bottle that I can fill with water. I am going to fill those. There we go. Alright. I'm going to bring a kitchen knife with me, because that's useful. Mmm, canned chili. I'm going to eat some corn. Ooh, ice cream. Alright, I'm going to dismantle the radio. I will dismantle everything I possibly can. There we go. There we are. Ooh, foraging. First skill book of the game that I remember, anyway. That I remember finding. Alright. Oh! Come on out, lady. Nope, nope, nope. Bad touch. Okay, so. You see the moodlet for pain. I've got exercise fatigue absolutely everywhere. So. I'm going to take the odd red book, because those help if my guy gets bored. And potentially depressed. Oh, good a saw. I need that. You know, in hindsight, I should grab the first aid kit, because I know I'm not going to remain that lucky. Okay. Tune you to living in life TV. Whoa. First, I gotta turn you on. Oh, yeah.
peanut butter and jam sandwich. And because I'm feeling saucy, a beef jerky sandwich. Mm. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> then I'm just going to sit on the ground, pull out that foraging book, and I'll speed up time for the reading. But because I'm also sitting in front of Living in Life TV, when it hits 12, we're going to be doing carpentry. My carpentry has just hit level one. That's done. Now the one good thing is your guy always, or girl, always remembers their place in the books. So I can read the book the next time. I primarily just wanted to do that so that I could get the, uh... Bleh, 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 bleh. The pain to go away. Alright, food is a big concern right now, so... Now. All right, let's go to the shed first and see what we can find. Ooh. Nah, just empty gas cans. Until I get a car, I don't need that much gasoline game. Come on now. Okay. Again. No key. Oh, this is rude. Didn't want that, but, you know. Guess it's kind of whatever. Ooh, duct tape. Binds the world together. So what do we got here? Pot of soup. I'm going to move that to the container. And I'm going to turn on the container. Ooh, I'm going to eat that lemon. Am I still obese? Yeah. I'm still obese. 
Though it looks like my weight is going down, so I'm doing something right. Right now, I don't want to burn it. Okay, it'll be good for a little bit. Never be too prepped. Oh, glug, glug, baby. This is burning my hands and I don't care. Okay. So, I'm going to remove these curtains to get a sheet. And those sheets I'm going to quickly shove into my backpack. Like usual, no car key. Kind of why I go around dismantling televisions and what have you. Speaking of dope, I know I've got a couple of things in here to dismantle. Pretty sure I have some... Yeah. So I'm going to dismantle the earbuds. Do I have... Yeah. Dismantle the watch. I think that was all I actually had. Either way, gotta get the electronics up so I can hotwire. Come on, I did that. Come on. Yeah, it's a shitter. There we go. And I will take a second crowbar. Quite the durable melee weapon. Alright. God, I need a box of nails. For more than one reason. Ooh, generator. Gonna have to take note of that. Oh, thank God. Oh, boy. You know, I knew my luck wasn't gonna last forever when it came to that. Okay, how broken is my lead pipe? Look oh, good.
Thunk. Now I'm a hard working man. Smack. Your face already it looks like it went through a meat grinder, lady. Get back. No, this hard working man is taken. I think. I mean, it's the apocalypse. No idea if she's still alive. Oh, there's one dead. There's two dead. Three dead. Four dead. Five dead. Ooh. Dismantle. Ooh, skizzers. How is that the right? Oh, right, the hammer. That's the holster. Eh, whatever. You can stay in the backpack. Okay. Now we're working on long blunt. I have no issues with that. And I thought I'd have my strength up by now. Eh, it's pretty close. All right. No, 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 no. Front door open? Nah, it's wishful thinking. But the living room's open. Porta disc. I'm going to dismantle both of those. Small little. I'm not even sure. Look, I'm going to be sleeping in this house, boys. Girls, whatever you are. Because leather is one of the harder ones to find. Alright, time to go upstairs, take a looky-loo. Baggy jeans. Should actually probably wear a long sleeve t-shirt. Just cause nipples. Mm, I'll take some vitamins. Because I never take them, pillows. There's a reason I want pillows, though. Under carpentry, you can make a bed. But first, you need a mattress. And to craft a mattress,
E5 pillows. Okay, so. No, 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 no. Just, just, just stop it. I'm opening that. Uh, well, actually, I'm going to rip the denim jeans. My t shirt, I'm going to turn into a sheet rope. Reason being, you can attach a sheet rope. It's not giving me the option, though, right? Because my box of nails ain't open. But doink. Why is it not letting me? Oh, I know why. I know why. Hold on. Hold on. Add escape rope. And I can close the window on it. Close curtains. Close curtains. And this is where I'm going to leave the character off today. In this house. And we're going to continue screwing around, hopefully trying to find a car so I can really go to the place I want to live. But until next time, everybody, I will see you later. I hope you enjoyed, and we'll bring more tomorrow. Bye!